What's up guys, Pixels here. So I wanted to make this video because as you guys can see, I love VR chat. Like lately, all my videos has been VR chat. Now there's a dozen reasons why I love VR chat, which I will show you guys when I actually do a review of the game. But I wanted to talk about the one thing that I really, really fucking hate about VR chat. Now you're probably thinking, what could it be? Now I'm gonna be honest with you guys, the one thing I really, really hate about VR chat is public rooms. Now I'm not trying to sound fucked up when I say this, but 90% of the people who play in public rooms are the stupidest people I have met in my life. The sad thing about that is they are the same gender. I'm pretty much gonna share a story with you guys of what really happened when I just joined a public room one day. Like before I used to always, you know, be in friends of friends rooms and everything is cool and chill. You know, no one's really loud. You know, if someone's loud, you know, we just address it and we move on that person respectful and that's about it. But one day a friend invited me to a public room. Now that was the first thing. Now, when I saw that invite, I kind of was like, do I really want to go to this public room? You know, I was, you know, considering the lag and everything like that. W what I ran into was not what I was expecting. So I went over there, right? And you gotta keep in mind that this person is a girl, right? This girl invited me over there to chill with her or whatever. Now, I don't know if it's rare to have a, a real girl as a friend on VR chat, you know, because I have a, pretty much a lot of them, right? I have pretty much a lot of them as a mo at the moment, but you know, it was just like, because this person was a girl, every guy in that, every guy in that public room act completely different. They pretty much acted like animals. They went from going up to the girl, asking if she's single, flirting with her, to saying all girls are aliens. Like they was talking about certain part of the body was being antennas or, you know, we go to work and they plotting against us, some shit like that. And it was just so fucking stupid. Like I really felt like that whole room was cancer. Like I understand what people mean when they say this game is cancer or that is cancer. Like that was seriously cancer. You know, at this point, I muted my mic. I was like, you know, I'm not even going to speak because if I speak, they're going to be like, oh, this guy is this, oh, God, this guy is that. And I just started to listen to him. And I started really thinking in my head, like, this is why certain guys are virgins. Like, this, this is the reason why. Because it just mind blows. It just fucks my head up when. And, and it's, it's sad because you look at them and why they're saying it, but then you look at them as the character that they are. You know what I mean? And. 90% and then half of them are girl characters so it kind of makes no sense what this what the topic was and then at one point I actually did mute my mic because another friend came there which was another girl and um I was just talking to her normally and just asked her about her day and stuff like that and the moment I spoke these guys was pretty much on my ass the whole time in the room now I could have easily left I know like you guys probably thinking well pixels you could have easily left um but I didn't want to be a dick I didn't want to come off as a dick because she invited me so i just stuck around try to you know you know fight it out and just say fuck it you know what i mean um another reason why i honestly hate public rooms is a lot of people will crash you like i wouldn't say this is a big thing because not a lot of people do it but you know sometimes you might come across some people who just come in the world and their whole objective is to crash you um, you won't get that if you're playing with a bunch of your friends. Um, but yeah, you do definitely have to look out for that if you do play in public rooms. This is not a big thing. I mainly hate this on Xbox. What in your fucking mind makes you think that everyone wants to hear your music? Mute your fucking mic. Like, stop letting your music come through your fucking speakers so everyone can hear it. No one requested it. You're not a fucking DJ. Just don't fucking do it. And if you're going to do it, at least let it be like calm music. Don't let it be some loud ass, stupid ass shit. Like, that's another reason why I just hate being in parties in general when people play music, or I just hate coming into a world and let's say you're streaming or something or you're recording. You don't fuck up someone's stream because most of the time, most people are probably streaming if they're in VR chat. You know what I mean? So just be considerate and stop playing fucking copyrighted music or music in general. Like, get that shit in your fucking headphones. Now, I'm not saying it's all bad. Like, if you first join vr chat i recommend going into some public rooms meeting some friends you know what i mean you got to make friends in order to get to that group of friends um but i do recommend like once you get a good group of people that you can really connect with add them you know then join them off the bat you know one day they might be in a friend of friend world you know and that's how you make your group of friends you know what i mean so like with me for instance you know i met my friend 
and then she introduced me to her friends and then her friends and to their friends and now we're just one big group um i kind of i kind of look at it as like a big vr family because i can tell you now i can talk to you guys about anything and don't have to worry about them judging you or you know saying you're doing this wrong or you know just someone to talk to you know so if you're starting out, join the public world, meet a few friends, get friends, like I said, get friends with them friends, and your experience will be a lot better. Um, but that's pretty much it, guys. I just want to make this video real quick talking about it because it just really made me never want to ever go. Because right now, I can honestly say this. If I have a choice to choose if we're going to a public room or a, pri or a friends-only room, I'm choosing that friend-only room. Public worlds, honestly, if you want free content, go there and record it. You, you'll hear the most dumbest shit in the world. Um, at the end of the day, this is a social game, so I understand why they need to have public worlds. But um, just be very, really cautious of what you're going to come into. Um, be prepared when you actually go in those type of worlds because it can really, really, really be bad um, when you're not considering like what people may or may not do in it. And the thing is, and I want to say this to the guys that play VR chat, be more considerate. Like, don't just go after the girl you know don't just harass the women who play vr chat you know it's not cool it's harassment and it's just honestly i feel like we could set up we could set a better example now don't get me wrong i do flirt most of my most of my viewers who know me you know i'm usually the guy who flirts i do flirt but i am i kind of make sure i'm respectful about it not coming off the wrong way so Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. Um, if you guys do play VR chat, leave your username in the comments below so I can add you guys. If you also play Orbis VR or anything like that, that has to do with VR, leave it in the comments below also and I'll add you guys. Just make sure you let me know if it's, it's your Steam account or let me know if it's your VR username and I'll add you guys. Um, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.